Hallo, ik ben Anna Schneider, veldtechnicus aan het Instituut voor Tropische Geneeskunde. In deze video laten we zien hoe we gastheren zoeken de vrouwtjes van de Ai de Steekmuggen vangen met de BG Sentinel. Deze val gebruikt een lokstof en CO2 om de vrouwtjes aan te trekken. Identify locations to place the BG Sentinel trap. Position the trap in a location that is sheltered from direct sunlight, heavy wind and rain. Do not place the trap in open space, tall grasses or under very dense bushes. If put on the bushes, respect a minimum distance of at least 0.5 meters above the trap to assure an optimal airflow and visibility for the mosquito. When placing the trap in a shelter or hangar, avoid contrasting backgrounds. The trap uses a dark blue and white color as a visual stimulus. To prevent theft, place the trap away from roads, tracks or any place easily accessible for other people. Each trap has a unique code. Take the coordinates of the trap location. Back in the office, an overview map is made. Keep this always up to date. Release carrying handle to allow the trap to pop up. Take out the funnel net, catch bag, BG lure and intake funnel. Lock the trap cover to the body of the trap. Attach the funnel net over the ring of the intake funnel. Make sure the seams of the funnel net and catch bag are facing outwards. This will help in the removal of the mosquitoes. Attach the catch bag over the funnel net. Tighten the drawstring properly and make sure it hangs out of the trap. Otherwise, it may get stuck in the fan. Insert the intake funnel into the trap cover. Rotate the funnel clockwise until it locks in place. Write the date onto the white top of the BG Lure cartridge and remove the label from the BG Lure. This lure is effective for five months. Insert the BG Lure cartridge in the hole. Connect the ventilator cable with a battery cable and twist the locking ring tight. The batteries are placed next to each other and each battery has its own waterproof box. Be sure that the battery poles are in the same direction. Connect the cable to the fully charged 12 volt batteries. Check if the right poles are combined. Red is plus and blue is minus. Make sure the connectors are tightened securely on the battery cap using a 13 mm wrench and that the battery cables are tucked away. Close the battery boxes and secure it. This setup of the batteries provides power for maximal two weeks. A connection plug can be used instead. Once the power is connected, the shutter automatically opens. If not, give it a press. Now the trap is operational and you hear the ventilator running. To connect the CO2 bottle, make sure it is in an upright position. Screw the pressure regulator clockwise onto the gas bottle. Tighten with the screw. Connect the CO2 emitter onto the BG Lure cartridge. Open the gas bottle by turning the valve counterclockwise. Adjust the pressure until the red line on the regulator. The CO2 timer is preset. Switch the display on. The letter R indicates the timer is running and the down arrow indicates CO2 emission. Install the rain cover if the trap is placed outside. Attach the sign with contact information. Make sure it is clearly visible. Keep the trap running. First lock the shutter of the intake funnel by pressing down on the locking tab. Remove the intake funnel by turning it counterclockwise and pulling it up. But hold it inside the suction current of the trap to prevent mosquitoes from escaping. Carefully slide the catch bag off the intake funnel and pull the drawstring tight. Trap mosquitoes should be handled carefully. Inspect the catch bag. If spiders or ants are present, squeeze them to avoid damaging of the mosquitoes. Place the catch bag with mosquitoes in a pre-labeled zip bag and put it in a cool box. Place a now empty catch bag on the intake funnel and place the funnel back into the trap. Disconnect the battery cable and exchange the empty batteries with fully charged batteries and reconnect. Close the valve of the gas bottle by turning it clockwise. Disconnect the CO2 regulator by turning it counterclockwise. Install the new gas bottle. 
always secure it to a tree or fence. Fill in the necessary information on the paper form or in the mobile app. Once back from the field, place the catch bag in the freezer for at least two hours until shipment. Send the catch bag and the paper form to the lab using the provided post boxes.